So what do you know about this guy, Durant? Oh, well, surely you don't need my help, right? Enlighten me. Hey, hey, hey! This guy Durant's a shooter, all right? We shouldn't be doing this without backup. You are the backup. I'm the backup. I hate him. I hate him so much. Now, you don't have to like me, but right now, there's no one else to do this job. OK, let me go. All right, look, we need to find these human traffickers. You're right, I don't like you. Son of a He was here when my father was murdered. I found his palm prints in the study, partial boot prints in here. Wait a minute, how do you know the boot prints didn't belong to Hess? Hess wears a size 11 like me, except double E. The prints I found were smaller. And Hess gets his footwork custom made, direct injected polyurethane midsole with a natural rubber outsole. Oh. You're, uh... Brain must be a miserable place. I need a beer. And you can stay. Just don't eat your own stuff. I have a napkin? Yeah. What was that look? What, they teach you how not to spill in the army? It's the Navy, OK? The Navy. It's not the spill. It's the tide. How are we taking the building? What do you think? I think if we get our eyes on our people and we go in hot. Is that what you would do? Yes, that is what I would do. See? This is partnership. It's like pulling teeth. You know what? He's angry because somebody came along and killed a member of his family today, and he feels like if he doesn't do something about it, nobody will. So let's prove him wrong. Come on, we got a job to do. There's something wrong with you. You know that, right? Law enforcement is Chin's family business, so when he lost his badge, he lost his family. If he wants to wear a badge, he has to be able to deal with things like this. You weren't held when you were a baby, were you? It's called tough love, partner. Ah. Oh, and by the way, I was held, OK? I have photos if you want proof. Photoshop. So you She's the reason the dog was broke out of prison? She just won a million dollars on a trip to Hawaii. OK, but why her? Like, there's not enough rich people on this island. Well, she's away from home. She's out of her element. Maybe Doc and Caesar is an easy target. Whatever, I need everything on Dana, OK? Travel itineraries, flights, car rentals. Hey, guess what? I've done this before, but thank you. It's a nightclub. Just sent us a link to remotely access their closed circuit feeds. It's really good. It's impressive. Did you learn that in SEAL school? Yeah, it's called using the internet. People have been doing it since the early 90s. You might have heard of it. I wouldn't know I was still playing Miss Pac-Man. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Ever make it to double pretzel level? Triple banana, bitch. You're a liar. Oh, well, not. And we would be remiss not to render assistance to that call. That call, I right? So. That's I right. Agree. Yes. Right. Oh, oh! What the hell are you doing? Probable cause. I thought we were just doing a thing. A th I meant that we'd get a key from the manager. You Neanderthal animal. You don't need it. Just go. Up, 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 up. Come on. Get up, face the wall. Put your hands. Turn around. That means you. Come on. Get in there. Danny. I have a number of a therapist that I want to give you, OK? Walk up steps like a human. You're not good. You're not Go, You're not go. Good. I'm so sick. So you know, I understand, OK? I would not mind a little one-on-one -on -one session with Jenna Kay. The thought does stimulate my imagination, too. Legally, the CIA can only interrogate foreign nationals. Why do you do that? My little fantasy worked out. I mean, well, you're like a devourer of dreams. You know what I mean? Like, you, you eat them. You're like a little Pac-Man in cargo pants. Thank you very much. Yeah, you heard him. Mr. Canada's not seeing any visitors today. Hmm. Huh. Please don't do that. What? Please don't put both your hands on the wheel. Every time you do that, something terrible happens, and I have to pray. Please. Just hang on a second. Wait. Wait. OK. Hey! You. 
don't forget. I don't even want to know what you would do. I, I would be by the book. The, the book? I would be by the book. Which book would that be? I ask. Huh? Patriot Act for Dummies? Mm -hmm. Hmm? How to nuke your enemies? War and peace? Minus the peace part? That's right, that's right. Okay, let me just make a statement, okay? Out of the top ten dopiest suggestion you have ever had. This is number one with a bullet. What idea is that? Oh, I'll tell you. He, uh, he wants to break into the governor's mansion. What? All those who think that's a certifiably demented idea, please raise your hand. Please raise your hand. I'm new. I didn't think I got a vote. You don't. Get on your way. You're not on your way anyway. You're a fugitive. You remember that? You heard the man. He's got something. Yeah, I heard him. We all heard him. He doesn't have anything. He's got an address. That's all. Unless, uh, Master Yoda can send telepathic messages that the rest of us cannot hear. Uh, actually, Yoda technically didn't have telepathic powers. Seriously? Right now? Please. Dressed up for the new governor? We need any points? Yeah, not exactly. Danny Williams. This is Officer Lori Weston. Hi. Hi. Our nice new partner. Nice to meet our new what? Part. Governor Denning assigned me to your 5-0 task force. To do what? Uh, assist you in any way I can. So I'm pretty sure the word you used earlier was babysit. You're gonna babysit. Oh, okay, I'm, I, apo I, ap I apologize. He, uh, he lost his man in somewhere between the womb and kindergarten. You will fit right in. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Come on, GQ. Duke's over here. Big working. You'll get your verdict. That's great, Ray. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> You're an animal. Okay. Good news is you're alive. Bad news is you're under arrest. Fuck him down. Come on. Okay, you know what I think it is? I think this is less about you protecting Gracie and more about you protecting yourself. Right, I forgot, because you're an expert on relationships. You're married with kids. You know everything. So let me ask you a question, genius. Okay, what happens when Grace gets attached and things don't work out between me and Gabby? Huh? Or what happens when things do work out between Gabby and I and then Grace doesn't like her? Then what? Then what do I do? Let me ask you a question. How are you gonna know if you don't try? What happens if you shut up and let me run my own camp and I'll introduce them when I feel like it's the right time? How about that? Can you hold on for a second? Okay, first of all, please slow down, okay? We don't even know which way they went. This road is the only way out of the marina. Easy, please, easy, speed racer, huh? Julie, this vehicle was engineered to be driven in this manner. Would you stop, Max? You're not helping. I Maynard, mean, I am personally responsible for that body, so hammer down, if you will. Kono, this is not a good time. You are interrupting vehicular manslaughter. You're chasing the morgue van, right? How'd you know? Seriously, where does Stratham think he's going? I think this tells us everything we need to know. Why do they always run? I believe it's because they are hoping that the person chasing them is going to end up wrapped around a telephone pole, which is very possible. I got my belt on. You're driving. We have a little talk now, please. Talk about what? Uh, I don't know the weather. I want to talk about what we're doing. This isn't the best time, Danny. See, that's where I disagree. I think now is the perfect time because I would like to be prepared. I need to know what's going on. I need to know if I need to put on some extra Kevlar. I need to know if I need to call my daughter and say goodbye for the last time. Let's talk about something that you are more familiar with, like uh, child endangerment. Let's talk about that. OK. I wouldn't have left your daughter if you'd have been doing your job as a father. How about that? Wow. OK. I don't like to run. All right? Why don't you get an apartment next door? Because you're here so often, huh? How about that? Fine, thanks for asking. Uh huh. Hey, Doc, make sure you punch his card, huh? Oh, look. Steve? Hey, sure is a good idea? Yeah, it's a stupid question. Hey, be careful. That's not, that's not in vocabulary. He doesn't know that one. Still with that? Six years. Since the day I met you, you've been telling me I've been trying to kill you. What's your point? What's my point? My point is, is getting old. You're very much alive. You're very much alive, which means I have your back. I've always had your back. So what are you talking about? Now return this to Universal Exports before you break it. It's indestructible, you idiot. All right, building secure. We're going in. 
All right, where's my vest? Where's your vest? Where are you going? Where am I going? I'm going across the street for a cappuccino. Where am I going? What do you think? What about the talk we just had? It was a very nice talk. I meant everything I said. I didn't say I was going to stand down. You're an idiot. I'm done. Wait, 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 wait a second before you strap up. Listen, we got more than enough guys in here. These guys. Hey, you want to see what I have for breakfast? Keep driving like a jerk. You man up once in your life. Man up. Man up. Talking to me, man, man up. up. The guy who saved your life going through life threatening surgery, oh, you gonna talk to me like God, that? God, we deliver up. again. How long are you gonna hold that over? Forever. Or until we die in a spectacular car crash three minutes from now. <laughs> Can you believe this guy? He's gonna sell it to his own people for a payday. He's making retirement money. What about loyalty? Loyalty? Lo bad guys today, Danny, they got no loyalty. There's no code, there's no honor, there's nothing. There are kingpins right now that are rolling over in their graves. I believe it, buddy. Maniac. Do you know him? Unfortunately, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Nice. You fail already? Duke call. Get in. Excuse me. I'm just curious. Are you completely whacked out of your head? What's the matter with you? Are you, uh... You got a better idea? I don't have a better... What are you still taking pills? I thought you were done with the pills. What, huh? the, you broke my liver and the doc put you back on them, or what? First of all, Danny, you can't break your liver. Go ahead. Steve, I have something to say. Again? Yes, again, okay? Nobody ever listens to me. If you want to die today, that's what you want to do, I'm fine with it. <laughs> can't you just say good luck? No, I can't say good luck, because the only way that luck plays a part in any of this is if you end up paralyzed instead of dead. I oh, appreciate the encouragement, Danny. Buddy, how you doing? You all right? Yeah. That was almost unpleasant. That was definitely almost unpleasant, yes. Woo! Wait a minute, were you worried about me, Danny? Just put the plane on the ground, please, maniac. Hey, I'm sorry. Did you just call me Maverick? Because if you did, that's like the greatest compliment you've ever given me. Thank you, I love you. Land the plane, you idiot. Copy that. Permission to buzz the tower. Steve, Steve, Steve. He's get, he wanted me to name the restaurant Steve's. I'll do it now in his memory. That's what we love about you, Danny. Always thinking positive. Every day. I don't live like a monk. Right? You know? No. How many dates you been on since you broke up with Lynn? Please get in the car. Zero. 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 Oh, yeah? Look who's counting. I'm, what am I counting? There's nothing to count. Zero and zero is zero. There's no, there's no math. Got I don't got to use my fingers. Zero, zero. Seriously? You're, you're a child. I didn't, uh, you know, I didn't mean to interrupt. What exactly did you uh, think you were interrupting? I don't know, the uh, grieving process? That's not what this is. Well, I liked it better when I thought you two were playing house. Who's that? This is Gregors Thompson. He's Omar Hassan's lawyer. Uh, 